Hey my beautiful team Flor J, how are you all doing? You're highly highly welcome to my channel. If today is your first time I've coming across this beautiful channel, you're highly highly welcome. Please consider to subscribe to see more of my creativity video for my OGs. Thank you for coming. So today my machine is faulty. It's not moving front, it's not moving back. So it's just in one place. You can see. So my sewing machine has been disturbing for about two weeks now and I caught someone and the person checked it for me and he said it's the teeth, the teeth is as falling down that I should raise it up. I did as he instructed and and this is the teeth you can see going up and down and I did as he instructed still the same thing so I decided to lose the entire machine okay so i decided to lose the entire machine to check what the matter is so if this is happening to you you just have to check two places if um it's the teeth or there is a knot there that is not tight so i unplugged it so that i'll be safe and i lose the machine i fell off check what's wrong i lose the done and um, this is the done remove all everything entirely the bolts everything i removed them and i checked what was wrong i'm not a professional in any way and this machine i can't afford to buy a new one for now that's why i'm going through all this process to check what the problem is like i said if yours is having similar problem you just have to check various parts to see what the matter is instead of going ahead to buy a new one if you can afford a new one no problem but if you can't just see what the problem is and fix it yourself okay so i just checked the needle pendant it's still very much smooth it's not chopped at all it's very smooth so i just went ahead to check some bunch of things that i feel might be the cause of it not moving right So I went into my tooth boss and I took my screw to check if all the knots are well tied. So I check all the knots are tied and this one moving front and back, I don't know the name, like I said, I'm not a professional in any way. And the man I called said I should put it in number two and my machine, it has been in number one. So I checked a bunch of things, check if, um, if your if your uh what's it called accelerator is on is on five or zero so you just check some things just check around then i went ahead and lose this part to see if the problem is from here as well so just check around i'm done losing so i want to lose this other part the damp part where the teeth which is the dog teeth of the machine is the teeth that allows it to move front and back that allowed your fabric to move front and back so i just took my brush and brush
so after i might have lose everything and i've gone through and checked then i um i, I just fix everything back okay so i just cover it and then i screw the knot back into it The moment of truth so i put it like that the fabric on it and i tried to see if it's working and it didn't work so i don't know what to do guys let me just i don't know child see my next video